Hi everyone, I'm Lillian. And I'm Felipe. And we're the Postmodern Family. We are Americans living in the UK searching for Great Britain. We make three new videos every week. We would love it if you subscribed. And in this episode we are... We are reacting to an interview of Ronnie Barker on the Terry Wogan show, or by Terry Wogan. We noticed that you guys really enjoy us reacting to the two Ronnies, and especially our most recent one, Ronnie Barker and his mispronunciation sketch. Sorry that we didn't know that ASS just meant donkey, and that A-R-S-E is the, uh, the, the term for bottom or bum. Mm. But in America, we don't delineate the two. In America, it's just A-S-S, mm. and we don't use the A-R-S-E spelling for that yeah so we just it just totally went that's just it we're americans <laughs> went over our heads um so clearly he wasn't being inappropriate he was just being funny so mm. anyway this is um we were curious to see what kind of true accents ronnie barker has because he seems to play so many different roles um mm. maybe we should react to the porridge one just so we can we'll do it after context. yeah so this um so so that's why we Googled and looked around for an interview of Ronnie Barker. Mm. With Ronnie Barker. I was going to ask you about the varicose and various parts. <laughs> <laughs> In the course. Uh, of course, how do you spell that? In the course of your television series. Why can't I get this question out of it? Comes me. In the course of your television series. <laughs> yes? In the course of my television series. In the course of my television what series. I remember talking. <laughs> Why are my questions longer than your answers? <laughs> Beryl Reed telling me that when she uh, starts to oh. take on a character. No, she didn't tell me oh, now. She, she, on. She's <laughs> come on. she said she starts from the shoes. She gets a pair of shoes and builds the character from She's the shoes. She's told me that. Yes, it's yeah. true. Yes, yeah. yeah. yes. Because she hobbles about the house in the, in the shoes. <laughs> Never mind that. <laughs> how, how do you construct a character? Do you take it from the shoes? I start up or, with or the, the voice. Underwear? The voice. The voice. I think of the voice first. Yes. I think, um, you know, I just like to hear yeah, the sound yeah. of the voice or whatever it is. You know. yeah. Or, uh, you know, Fletcher, I mean, you know, Nepple. That's my expression. That's Fletcher's expression, you know, nap off. It's not... It's not Princess Anne. No, no, no. no. Nap off, so no, no, cool. No, no. And, I, and then from the, from the voice comes the face, I think. Uh, the Welsh one, you know, Welsh, you see. Your eyes go on a cat. <laughs> I think people's... I think accents come... Uh, I don't know if it's accents cause the shape of the face or the shape of the face. I think it's the shape of the face that causes the accent. I think because French people are all going on. Scottish people, if you if you all put your face like that <laughs> and speak normally, you sound quite Scottish. You know? The Scottish people have a face like that. <laughs> <laughs> like Popeye. <laughs> what about Irish? You don't do. Paul is saying you're not all that. Irish people are very soft, gentle, and and. Is he Irish or something? So, you know, <laughs> Sure, no, that's very easy to But I noticed you don't do much of the old Irish accent. Why is that? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I like you because you're a, you're a very well set up man. Fat, you know. Fat? Like oh, that's what they're going to set up. You know this latest thing about keeping fit? We've all seen Harry Seacum. Harry Seacum now has lost four stone. He Rape weighs like. exactly the same as me now. 14 stone 10. He is the same height as me. But I now look twice as big as him, don't I? Can do that. We are the same. But, we are the, can I stand up? Yes, yeah. sir. I, I mean, may I stand up? I should have I know I can't. I haven't been drinking. <laughs> <laughs> no, what a fine thing. What a fine <laughs> thing. <laughs> well, what... <laughs> <laughs> but you see, I look twice as big as Harry. <laughs> Oh, Terry. <laughs> oh, that's Eric Morgan, yeah. Do you think if you did lose weight... Oh, my feet, eh? Yeah. You know, put them up here. Do you think oh, yeah. if you did lose weight... Yes. <laughs> ...that you'd lose some of your, your charm and popularity? Uh, well, I wouldn't lose any of my charm. I might lose a little popularity, I suppose, yes. Uh, what kind of knots have you got in these? <laughs> <laughs> the John knots, they are. Yes, right. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, uh, he, uh... You're looking for holes in my socks? Well, just... <laughs> I was letting him tie them together. I thought he was going to tie the two together. <laughs> See, I was playing feed. Ah, uh, old pixie. Uh, yes. Are you a funny man at home? No, I never go home, no. <laughs> I'm 
sort of, I, I, sometimes I'm funny, I make my wife laugh. She'd laugh to see a pudding crawl as they say. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the essence of a happy marriage, as long as you can make your wife oh, laugh. Oh, yes. Well, I made her laugh the first night. <laughs> what? <laughs> so then, like, do you want to play that other... No, actually, I, th I thought I just remembered because it's BBC. It's All really right. Locked, so... Mm -hmm. so... Um, yes, yeah, so he clearly like... has a high accent, right? Hmm, yeah. And according to his Wikipedia, he didn't go to Cambridge or Oxford. He just went to a high school for boys. Yeah, in Oxford. Not everyone in Oxford is posh, honey. There, there's City middle... of Oxford High School. <laughs> there's working class normal people in Oxford. I've met oh, them. Right, right, right. Hmm. Yeah, he's got a higher accent, which is surprising because he pulls off the other accents so well. Hmm. And I think it's true. I think the shape of the face... Makes the accent? Like, really helps you... Keep the accent. I mean, mm. it, yeah, I think. Are you going to try a Scottish <laughs> accent like with that face? <laughs> What's an English actor? <laughs> Comedian and writer. <laughs> oh, and the Welsh? Are you going to try the Welsh one? What face do they have? He know. said they have like really big eyes and then he kind of sticks his, his chin forward. Hmm. Who was that? This one right here. Um, that was the Irish. There's the Scottish. I didn't catch the Welsh. The Welsh one was the one with the big eyes. Hmm. That one. Hmm. <laughs> like really expressive eyebrows. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think I've seen that. You have? I think I have, yeah. Who's Welsh that we know that... I took a course with a Welsh lecturer. Oh. And he was very animated, yeah. His face? <laughs> yeah. And then does that make mm. you have his... inflections in your voice? Yeah, sing-songy. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Interesting, interesting. Mm. So we have to do an accent video. Mm. When is that going to happen? I don't know. Are you going to do the Scottish one? But um, yeah, I, I, I appreciate uh, Ronnie Barker more after watching this because he seems quite... Very talented. Very talented and what, yeah. Funny man. Yeah. Everyone loves a funny man. Hmm. Hmm. Someone was saying that there's a lady, a lady actress who's a comedian, mm. Dame Edna something. So what was his fame? What was the era of his fame? Oh, he was born quite a while ago, so 29. Wow. Hmm. Let's see his film career. I should have a little table here on Wikipedia, I think. Okay. So 60s. And 70s. Where are the two Ronnies? It's not a film. It's television. Oh. Here we go. Look at that. 60s. The two Ronnies are there. Between 70s mm. and 80s. Oh, a wow. Span 16 of 18, years. Oh, 16 years. <laughs> he had a prolific career then. Yeah. He started out in the 60s. Wow. And kept doing shows. All the way into 2000. Mm. Is that true? Mm. When did he die? 2005. Wow. Yeah. So he was, what, 70, 76. Six. Mm -hmm. 76. So he must have been the comedian du jour for the late, tw for the 20th du century. Du jour, du like century. <laughs> <laughs> the whole... It, like his mm. whole career, sixty to yeah, forty years. Yeah, mm. that's a lot, that's a big chunk mm. of time. Yeah. Hmm. So who followed him up is the question I would have for the commentators. Who took the baton from Rowan Ronnie... Atkinson? I don't know. <laughs> Mr. Bean. Or do you say the baton? The baton. The baton. Oh yeah, the baton. Yeah. We say the baton. Do yeah. you, what do they say? Baton. The baton. Mm -hmm. Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge, like that. Baton. Mm -hmm. Baton. Thanks for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it. Let us know if you enjoy these kinds of videos and reactions, and leave us more comments to videos that you think we should react to. And if you really like what we do, you can become a patron at patreon.com slash the postmodern family. You're free to donate as much as you like uh, per month, and with 
your donation, you get access to us for live feeds um, on a monthly basis and um, a nice thank you card from Lillian. And more importantly than what you get is that you guys really benefit a family, a growing family. We're going to have another child in May 2020 and also growing this channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.